Thank you, Rob. More than 100 people spent the night outside last night, and it was all for a good cause. Wayne 15's Rachel Russell joins us live from the Karis house where they just woke up. Hey, Rachel. Yeah, that's right, Sierra. 125 participants last night raised money for the rescue mission. Now, they spent the night out in tents or on boxes or just sleeping on the ground to find out what it would be like to spend one night without a home. I just wanted to show support for the rescue mission and help raise people's awareness and just experience what it's like to uh, not have those essentials that we all take for granted in life. We just love what they do. Uh, she does this every year. I'm usually working, but she got me out here this year to, to do it as well. Whatever their reason, more than 100 people gathered at the Karis house to experience what it's like to spend one night without a home. And at around 2 o'clock this morning, I heard words like cold and uncomfortable. I laid down for a little bit, but just being on the hard ground, it's, it's a struggle. And being in the cold. And I was like, man, this is tough. So I just got up to walk around and... I don't know if I'm going to try to sleep anymore tonight. It's going pretty good. It's not as cold as uh, I think what I expected tonight. I think normally it's probably a lot worse than this, so we're just getting a small taste of what I think people deal with. And some even went the extra mile, or in this case, no tents allowed. Yeah, no tent. This is, we're trying to do it as real as we can. You know, she, she likes to go hardcore, so we're just going with just the box, no tent. But this night is much more than just raising money or sleeping outside for the experience. It's more than just giving change, but it's giving relationship and it's showing um, people in need that we care about them, that we'll, we're willing to spend time with them, we're willing to want to identify with them and somehow bring them hope and encouragement. We're trying to raise awareness about homelessness in our community and we know it's not exactly what it's like to be homeless but it's still it's 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 uncomfortable and it's tough and it's cold I was laying down earlier this ground is just so cold um, and it's impossible to get comfortable and it really makes you think um, and empathize with with the homeless and that's really what we want out of this event the rescue mission has been doing this for five years now and their goal this year fifty thousand dollars and this bunch has just about reached their goal. Anyone who needs a place to stay or breakfast, lunch, or dinner, 365 days a year, we've got it. Um, and we're here for those people. Our hope is that someone will enter a long-term program to get to the root cause of their homelessness. And that really gives them hope and a, a chance to move forward, to not be homeless anymore. Even when the night gets cold and the ground might not be the comfiest place to sleep, there were still smiles on their faces. Prayer, hot chili and hot dogs, uh, good community, some shared chat around campfires. It's been a fun night. The group just walked over from the Karis House here to the rescue mission to go through the breakfast line and to share some of their stories from the night. Now, if you still want to go donate to these fundraiser pages, you can find the link to do so in this story on our website, wayne.com. For now, live downtown, Rachel Russell, Wayne 15 News.